Right, hello. Um, real quick before we get started with the video, we're really close to 500 subscribers. So if you're not already, please subscribe. That would be great. Um, and also when we get to 500, I was going to do a QA and a on my Instagram. So make sure you're following that and keep an eye on the stories because that's probably where I'm going to do it. Um, and yeah, best question, I guess, can uh, or joke actually, yeah. Best question or joke can have my old carbon fiber eyelids and wing mirrors if you want them. If not, I'll give them away to someone else. But yeah, make sure you're following Instagram here. Um, yeah, keep an eye on that. I'll do a post probably when I get to 500. And then you guys can just keep an eye on the story and we'll go from there. Make a video on it. Thank you. Enjoy the video. It's a wreck. Bye. Right. Hello. It's uh, It's been a minute. Um, as you can see, I'm, I'm somewhat different. I've actually moved um, and just been super busy. So I haven't been able to have the chance to even work on the car or do anything with the car. I've barely even driven it in the past like month and a bit. Yeah, going down to Amigo Customs, getting a new split fit, and then I've got a bunch of other car parts that we need to fit over the weekend. So this video is just gonna be kind of all of that in one. Um, and yeah, cut to me driving, I guess. God, I'm out of practice. Right, we've got a little bit of open road here. So hopefully I can let loose a little bit. road comes to an end good um, suppose the intro was a bit of a mess and I should probably explain what is going on so Amiga Customs fit my previous splitter which <laughs> I accidentally deleted um, here is a video clip somewhere of what happened um, and if you listen closely you can hear the exact moment it comes off uh, yeah so it's taken me a while to get my hands on another one I've just been busy uh, moving work shit like that so yeah finally got my hands on one I've gone for a gloss black one this time instead of a carbon one because you'll see later in the video but I'm just gonna do a carbon delete pretty much um, it's all fake carbon so just might as well go gloss black um, I've got a new spoiler to fit, some dynamic indicators, and something else. Uh, it's all going to go on in this video, um, and hopefully have the car looking like something new, really. Give it a bit of a different look. Um, I suppose we'll have to wait until the finished product to see if that's accurate or not. Um, I can't remember, this is a fucking bumpy bit of road. There are speed cameras around here, and I got that. There they are. Just hope I wasn't going too fast there. Oh well. Um, yeah, so guys at Amiga Customs getting this fit for me, spoke to them, they're able to fit me in uh, on a pretty tight schedule, which big shout out to them for. I know a lot of places have quite a long waiting list um, and sort of don't really care but I think because I've used them a couple of times they're happy to fit me in um, yeah I think that is kind of the gist of it like I said the video is going to be a mess um, but that is the standard of this channel so if you don't like it don't watch my video no I'm kidding please watch my videos this car really needs to be cleaned but the wheels sheesh Scratching the bonnet. Sheesh. Need need to fix that. These are gonna go. These are also gonna go. These are gonna get changed. And yeah. Should be good. Right, that is it done. The split is on. It took all of five minutes for them to do it, which is great. But yeah, that's on. Um, nice, quick. 
got me in, got me done. Like I said, my point was at 12, it's now 12.05, so they bolted it in. Should be pretty secure. Um, I'm now gonna find some food, I think, because I'm starving. Right, quick pit stop is completed. Had to grab a quick Greg's because I was starving. Um, split is still on the car. I'm now gonna give it a bit of beans on the way home and see if it stays on. Uh, if not, I'll be going right back to Southampton. Oh, an S5. Right, let's get going. So I'm about to head back to my parents because there's a bunch more car parts there. Um, it's a lovely day out. So I'm just gonna go and hopefully chuck all these parts on my car without any issues. It should be an easy job. Famous last words. Um, so yeah, we did Amigo Customs yesterday. My splitter was under warranty, which is why I went back there because they were able to just fit it for me and I didn't really have to worry about it. Um, yeah, I didn't get to film as much there as I thought I would, purely because I wasn't there for as long as I thought I was going to be. Um, I was on the phone for the majority of the time I was there, so I just couldn't really film at the same time. But yeah, let's quickly run over to mine, my parents even, and hopefully fit some car parts. Look at this bird ship. It's just disrespectful. In typical fashion, I've just got home uh, to my parents and I've forgotten the adapter for my tripod because I'm filming on my phone. Um, <laughs> so this is gonna get interesting and I'm gonna have to be really creative on how I film this. <laughs> also say hello to the chief mechanic. Any words for the camera? Hey, excuse me, sir, can I get a comment? I have an idea. I'm gonna fix the lack of camera mount the same way I fixed my brake light. Electrical tape. This could only go well. I 
think I've done it, boys. <laughs> the only issue is, I can't really see what I'm now recording. Um, but... <laughs> This channel is a fucking joke. So I'm gonna follow Alex the Grumpy One's video on how to remove this, if anyone needs to know. That'll be linked down below. Uh, but essentially, it'll change these to dynamic indicators, but that would, uh, it will change these to dynamic indicators and also give it a blacked out look, uh, which would go really well with the new wing mirror caps I've got, which are gloss black. Obviously, as my phone's recording, I can't really use it to watch videos, so I'm going off pure memory here. Um, and hopefully I don't break anything that I need. But yeah, that's, might as well just get into it. All right, well, that's that off. Anyone that wants this, let me know. There's a set going. Um, you might be asking why am I getting rid of the gloss black? Fuck me, that is dirty. A spider definitely lives in there. That's definitely a spider's egg sack. Oh, look at that. That's definitely spider eggs. I'm like, oh, it might not be. Anyway, let's just get this out of there. Ooh. Right, got the screw out. Now let's not lose this and we'll put it somewhere really, really safe. Uh, and hopefully find it later. Done. Well, half done. I've now got to put it back together with the new one. This is the wrong side. Oh. Right, I need to clip this in. Yeah, that way. Not that way. Yeah, that way? No, not that. Yeah, this way. I'm losing a battle to a clip. I've won the battle. I hope. Should we just... Oh! So I threw the screw as a joke. I didn't actually throw it. I put it in my pocket. Um, it's now gone and I don't know where. So this might actually be an issue. But like I'm thinking, because I didn't throw it and I only put it in my pocket, it can't have gotten far. I found it. Righty tighty. Now it's time to reassemble it and put on the new Okay, with a bit of wrestling, I actually managed to get it on. One thing I already hate, this thing is a bloody fingerprint magnet. I know I'm not really going to be touching it much, but... But yeah, it is on. Uh, and this is how they look now, compared to how they looked before. So it's more of a blackout design. I don't know if I prefer the black over the carbon fibre, uh, in all honesty. However... I'm just getting rid of all the carbon fiber on my car. So these are going, those are going, and I have a new spoiler to put on, which we're also doing in a second. But yeah, I think I'm just going for the blackout kind of vibe. I think it looks pretty good. But yeah, I'm gonna quickly chuck the other one on, then we'll move to the spoiler. So we've done the wing mirrors. Now it's time for the more important, the more, the blah, 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 blah. God help me, I'm also. Right, the wing mirrors are done. Now it's time for the spoiler. Uh, this one has actually been really good and I've really enjoyed this one. I think for its price, it's one of the better options. I know a lot of people like the Vortex one that I tried to buy. I think it not fitting was actually a blessing in disguise because I'm not that big a fan on them. Uh, some I like, I actually quite like the longer, bigger ones like M's. I really like his. Uh, I did think about getting one, but just, 
honestly just decided against it. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna remove this and put on my new one, which is an OSIR model. And hopefully it fits. They are meant for the pre-facelifts. So I've taken a gamble and we're gonna see. And before I remove this, I'm gonna roughly line it up. Oh, it wants me to screw it in. Nah, I reckon, I reckon tape will hold it. That might still be reusable if this doesn't work. That will probably do. Now let's do a proper test fitment and pray that it fits. <laughs> it's covered in rubber. So it should all line up pretty well. I think there's gonna be a gap towards the front. Um, just because of the design, yeah, it's going to be kind of like that. Apart from that, I'd say this is sitting pretty well. That feels off. Hold up. Stop moving, please. I don't know, maybe that's okay. It's got like the little lip in here, like here, which is meant to go with the contour. Which bit did I say I need to 3M tape? Like all of it, I suppose. Take a while. Ah. <laughs> look how wonky this is! It doesn't look too bad at the camera. Yeah, no, I this was dead straight. Don't listen to anything anyone else says. It, I promise you, it's dead straight. I did think about a bigger spoiler. Uh, I could have got one like M's, or even one like Luke's, which is like massive. Um, yeah, I don't know. I thought this was a good in-between balance from what I had, the little temporary one. And, um, well, M's basically. M's is cool and looks sick and I probably should have just got one of them. But I'm not gonna let him know that. Let's hope he doesn't watch this video. Ooh, that was satisfying. That looks right there, but not on this side. Oh, got it. No! Oh, that's so not ideal. Shit. 3M tape is really stretchy, you know? Um, but that is a pain because I'm gonna have to relay that one now. Luckily, the company I bought this from knew I was incompetent when it comes to using tape. So, there are plenty left. I have some left. <laughs> I'm out of 3M tape and I've not even covered it. It's not straight. How's your day going? While I'm sat here for a minute, let's talk about today's sponsor, my bank account. My bank account is really good because it doesn't have much money in it, but I still buy stupid stuff. Um, <laughs> now, I don't know much about cars, but I know it's not good where you can do this with the spoiler. I think more 3m tape was required and i've left it to that awkward point where this is probably all set now and taking it off means means more work um i think i've given it some thought apparently it's meant to be self-tapped in not going to do that um someone suggested i tiger seal it i'm also not going to do that because i don't have any i think i'm going to rip it off put the thicker 3m tape on because that has yet to fail me um, and just kind of see what happens when I do this. Honestly, came off a bit too easy. Probably good that I'm changing it. <laughs> this is the current setup we're rolling with. Um, as you can see, I've just gone a bit ham with the 3M tape to make sure it stays on. Um, I don't think 
this lower bit actually like sits on anything. Those are the holes that you're probably meant to tap it in with. Um, but we're not doing that because I don't know how to and I don't really want to drill through this. So let's just see if it goes on. I don't know if this is straight. you know what just gonna go for it because i'm now getting bored and impatient again gloss black i thought was gonna be a really good idea you know get rid of the fake carbon fiber replace it with gloss black and um yeah i'll be sad i forgot how much of a fingerprint magnet black is just like gloss black just attracts so much crap I should have washed my car before doing this because I'm ideally going to want to leave it a bit of time before I wash it after this. Just, you know, make sure I don't power wash the spoiler off. What am I doing in my life? Right, the, uh, it's on. I just need someone to inspect it. So bear with me real quick. Right, sir. What do we think of this? How is it? Is it good? Is it good? What do you think? Do you like it? No, you're meant to inspect it. Look, come here. Uh, dude. Dude, you're meant to inspect. What the hell? Just come in. Right, you're gonna inspect and you're gonna do a good job. Inspect. How is it? Is it stable? Is it road legal? What do we think? Yeah? No? What about the underside? Even on the brake lights, they're being fixed. I need some friends. Guys, so getting these off should be pretty simple. That being said, they've been on there quite a while. So, where's that price all? High quality manufacturing, this. We're just gonna, we're just there, there, but it's, oh. Literally perfect. I'll tell you what, I'll chuck these into the giveaway as well. So make sure you're following my Instagram because that's where I'm gonna ask all the questions. I'll try to take some from YouTube if there are any decent ones and mainly if I remember. But yeah, best comment gets the carbon fiber wing mirrors and the eyelids. And yeah, I've probably forgot something so I'm sure you'll see me in my room to do a proper outro. Right, if you made it this far, thank you for watching. Um, yeah, check out the Instagram, keep your eyes open there. Like I said, we're real close to 500, so if you could subscribe and share this, that would be great. And um, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Meow. Meow meow. Meow. Meow meow.